afternoon, guys. And uh, I've just been bowled over over the last few days. We were getting to condition critical, but more selling than, than coming on. But I've now been given the chance to market this one exclusively. We're going to call it Villa Oleander. Stunning, stunning villa. Beautiful design, very different on the inside, as you'll see in a minute, but set in kind of 650, maybe 700 metres of, of grounds, as you can see. Pristine swimming pool out the front here. Low maintenance gardens, lots of it's been terraced. And when I go over to the other side, you can see, you'll, you'll see the, the stunning, stunning views. It's in the Perla, very easy walk to Arbalest Centre. The double doors there go into a huge lounge diner. That's the front door into a central hallway. And then just over on my left hand side here, you've got this gorgeous covered corner porch and that goes into the kitchen utility area. So I've just come back around here into the driveway. As you can see, wonderful pressed concrete. You've got electric gate access. And then the owners put this fantastic privacy wall, which divides the pool area. So the pool totally not overlooked, very, very private. The driveway carries on all the way up here passing the corner porch and then you've got a kind of it's not really big enough for a garage it's got a garage door in it but it's a, a large lockable store shed at the back here and then look let's pan around now check out these absolutely stunning views there in the background just beautiful and guys you know this is March look at those stunning blue skies there I've actually got a jacket on again and I'm cooking. So we'll take a, a wander down to the right hand side of the property. This is a, again a second home, has been for a long, long time now, but beautiful full time residence if required or perfectly safe lock up and leave. I mean, you get great rental potential on this if you wanted to rent it out for holidays to the, when you're not using it. But look at this huge terrace there. Going into the lounge area again on the left. And then this is double doors into uh, the dining room, living room from here. So if you saw, you've got three doors on the frontage. That's the fourth door out to the garden, into the property. Coming around the back garden here. nice shaded area I mean nothing's really been done with this there's a little dining patio there I suppose and it's it's nicely situated because what you'll see in a second this is double doors off one of the, 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 the main guest bedroom essentially so if you've got guests over put a lovely little coffee table or table and chairs outside here and they've almost got their own little private terrace this is the wonderful store shed and then the end of the driveway. So let's go and take a look now on the inside. So coming from pool side, in through the central front door, into a large central hallway that connects essentially to all the key rooms. So first door on the left hand side, very handy because if you come back from the shops and you need to spend a penny, Great to have a WC just inside the front door. But beautiful glass block shower area, double shower, bidet, usual WC, hand basin, etc. Then a really lovely central kitchen. And this runs all the way along here. And then at the end, you'll see an arch, and that goes out into a small utility area. You can see double fridge off of here. And then this door takes you straight out of the kitchen out onto the covered porch. So the porch is fantastically positioned so you can sit under there, get wonderful shade and drinks and snacks and everything straight out of the kitchen into the garden. Now, this is beautiful design, this. I, I love this and very unusual. I don't think you've seen many like this, but look at this stunning lounge diner. I'll give you a pan around from both sides. So. around 32 meters, I'd say. Air conditions, you can see there. Sorry, I don't know what's going on with the camera there, but it's bobbing in and out of focus. Double doors out to the garden you saw from the outside. And then this gorgeous open lounge. 
and further double doors. So double doors off to the right and double doors off to the left. So off the lounge dining, you've got two wonderful sets of double doors straight out to the garden and the entertaining areas. Let's have a little pan around from this side. You're overlooking the pool, as you can see there, hopefully in the background. Just a beautiful, bright, open room. Back out to the central hallway. Splits off to the left there, so you've got the master bedroom here right in front of you. You saw that's got, you know, can be used as a master or the guest, but you've got double doors out to that little kind of terraced area, patio, fitted wardrobes in all the bedrooms. So you can see floor to ceiling, double bank there. And then top spec Mitsubishi air conditioning unit up above you there, the double doors out, pan around. And then a lovely bathroom en suite. Same theme as the, the main family bathroom has been continued in here as well. Okay, and then, hi guys, I've just got myself in the mirror, did the usual. And then, main guest bedroom up to the right here. There's an aircon unit, but that's just up here above my head onto the right, it's a bit difficult to bring in onto the film. Again, whole bank of fitted wardrobes in here. I'm not going to catch myself in the mirror this time. It's my birthday today, by the way. Hey, nothing like working on your birthday. <laughs> Maybe I should call this Villa Birthday, I don't know. And then arch access here into the smallest guest bedroom, the third. It's a double, gone for two single beds in here again. Fitted wardrobes, just beautifully bright. Spacious rooms, very contemporary design. Key okay, ready, you know, ready to move into this one. So, Villa Oleander, 199,950 euros. In La Perla, you know the sketch if you'd like to have a view. Viewing then we'd be delighted. You can get in touch with us, Kalidahomes at hotmail.com. Give us a call, plus three four nine five oh four three oh seven six three or plus three four six three four three zero two eight zero one. But you're bored of hearing the sound of my voice. But I'll leave you on this beautiful backdrop. Look forward to hearing on this one, guys. See you soon.